So BJ Hill claims whatever the Bengals defensive problem is, is minor and entirely fixable. All right. So if that's the case, then what's the solution? If it's a small problem, then what's the solution? If it's a small problem, BJ, sorry, his name, um, then Luana Rumo should come out on a press conference this week and say, here's the problem. Here's why we've been slacking. Here's why we've been arguably the worst defense in the NFL. And here's how we fix the defense. That's what he should do as of this week. Tuesday through Friday, I want a Lou Anarumo press conference. Because if you're telling me that what I saw the last couple of weeks outside of the Chiefs game, if you're telling me that is minor, and that is, oh, it's not that bad, you know, it's really just a simple, quick fix, actually. It's a one, two, three. <laughs> if that's the case, then I want him to ex describe what the problem is. And if that's also the case, we should allow less than 10 points against the Giants. The Giants game should be an uh, other blowout. Because if, again, BJ here, you claim that this is a minor and fixable issue, then fix it. Then figure out the problem. Then there shouldn't be a problem. If it's small and minuscule and it's all, oh, it's barely an issue. It's a, it's a, you know, it's pretty much nothing, actually. We're just the worst defense in football right now and can't stop a middle school offense. Oh, it's, it's nothing, really. Is that, it's actually such a small problem. It's actually, you don't even, guys, we don't even have to worry about it. Like, it, it really is nothing. If that's the case, then again, this week should be the best Bengals win of this season. This week should be a slaughter fest against the Giants. Because we know offensively we can beat their defense. But the question is, can we shut down their offense? We should be able to. And if this is just a small minuscule problem, then this issue shouldn't be an issue anymore. Here's what I'll say. Is this same issue that BJ Hill is talking about? Has is this the same issue it has been the whole entire season? Or is this a new issue? Or is the issue Luana Rumo? And that would be a minor issue. Because the way to fix it is fire him. Right? And fire Bill Bilicek. That is a very quick fix. Listen, I don't think what's wrong with our defense is minor in any circumstance at all I really don't think it is I think getting back guys getting healthy is really good and I think that is a huge W but I still think we have to worry about our pass rush our problem with our defense is not easily fixable it's not minor it's a pass rush problem we got run stuffers back right yesterday outside the final play we shut down the run. We did a really good job shutting down the run. But we can't get to the quarterback. Quarterbacks can sit back in that pocket and bake cookies. They can literally, you know, do their tax returns. And honestly, they could probably put Yahtzee back in that pocket with how long we give them to chill in their pocket with. That's our biggest issue. Is we can't put pressure on anybody. If we could get... Two or three sacks in a game. That would be the best game of all time. That's our biggest issue. And until we fix that big issue of a pass rusher. We need a pass rusher outside of Trey Hendrickson. Then it, the defense is fixed. And maybe it is fixable. Go make a trade. Go make a trade and go get somebody. Go get somebody I don't know. I I have my ideas, obviously, of who I would like. But, you know, that's just my personal ideas. My personal ideas is I say we go and get Max Crosby. Or we go get um, Josh Hines Allen. 
or, you know, fluff it. Uh, Cleveland won't give us Miles Garrett, but go get somebody. Go make a big trade. Go put your money where your mouth is, right? Go get someone amazing. That's what we need right now. We need a difference maker outside Trey Hendrickson on that defensive line. That is what's going to make this defense better. That's what's going to make this defense elite. That's what's going to fix this season. You have to get somebody. Miles Murphy is not the guy. Not right now. And honestly, by the time he would technically become the guy, I think it might be the season is already over at that point. We need somebody. We need to get somebody. Add somebody. We need an actual true playmaker on this defensive line outside Trey Hendrickson. And if Trey Hendrickson is going to be continuously asked to be the only guy to get this job done or to be able to do anything, you're going to continue to lose until that's the problem. Well, lose on defense. I think we're going to win games. 100% I think we're going to win games. I think we're going to win the next four games in a row. Potentially the next five. But it doesn't mean that the problem is fixed. We're going to be able to take advantage of a lot of weak teams that we're playing in the next five weeks. And that's good. It's great. Our defense is probably going to do what they did against Carolina, where they're going to be competent. And with our line getting better health-wise for our defensive line for run-stuffing, we'll do a great job of stopping that. But the problem is, outside of that, because when you get to the playoffs, you don't get to play the weak teams. You have to play the best of the best. Baltimore, Buffalo, you have to play the best of the best. And the sad part is, this defense, if it is easy fixable, and it's a minor issue, then it needs to be fixed. Now, not, oh, well, we're going to hear this same crap every single week. Because, again, if it is easy fixable, and it's a minor issue, then someone needs to be fired. Because it should have been fixed already. And if it's not fixed when it's easy fix, then someone needs to be fired. Now, if it's a hard fix, if it's a very, like, if it's right now we're in the crapper, then no one needs to be fired. Because then that's just an issue of, you know what, it isn't working out and our personnel can't get the job done. The ball is in your court, Luana Ramel. The ball is in your court. You're pissing away one of the best offenses in Bengals history. You got to stop, man. Or figure something out.